This is Bumper to Bumper TV. Volkswagen is dipping another toe into the hybrid pool, this time with the Jetta sedan. The compact is already a sales leader for the brand, and with a hybrid, it's expanding the lineup to attract potential green buyers. At first glance, there isn't much different about the Jetta Hybrid, unless you count the blue-tinted badging on the rear, the front fender, and the grille. There are also some subtle differences in the lower body skirting to increase fuel efficiency, which is the mantra for building a hybrid. Under the hood, this Jetta operates with a lithium battery-powered electric motor rated at 27 horsepower. It shares space with a 1.4 liter turbocharged direct injection 4 and cylinder engine rated at 150 horsepower and 184 foot pounds of torque. Volkswagen links these power plants to a 7 speed DSG automatic transmission. It's a design that the company thinks is a winner in the hybrid segment. This is also then uh, providing also when you go higher speeds um, where the electrical motor is not contributing so much with a very high fuel efficiency on one side, on the other hand, such an engine with its response also in combination with the DSG transmission is really, you know, the factor which makes fun to drive um, and a, a lot of experience. During an afternoon of driving through the mountains of New Mexico, we found there's a near seamless transition between the dual power systems, even from a standing start. At that time, EPA fuel economy numbers weren't available, but VW engineers estimate the Jetta Hybrid will deliver a combined fuel efficiency of 45 miles to the gallon. Low resistance tires contribute to getting to that number. In our view, a good set of all season radials would deliver better handling in real world driving conditions. Like other hybrid offerings, the Jetta can also operate in an electric only mode at a start at up to a top speed of 37 miles per hour, where that's when the e-drive function is engaged. Now to make that work requires a very deft touch on the accelerator before the gasoline engine kicks in. VW officials admit they don't expect the Jetta Hybrid to be much more than 5% of the total sales for the model, but they're hoping it will get the attention of drivers who normally would not associate the brand with a gasoline electric drivetrain. This is Greg Morrison. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper TV at cs.com.